Hey guys, welcome to WAC Tutorial. In this video, we will learn about building multiple articles at once and then building multiple campaigns at once for GSA Search Engine Ranker. As you know, we recently added a public API to our software. When you build articles with WAC, you can now export all the articles with titles to our database and download them in GSA at once. In GSA, we have two ways to fill content. One is this data field and the other is Article Manager. We have already covered the data field in a previous video. Here we will cover the next part. In WAC, first you need to build articles. But first, let's change the number of articles we build. We go to Settings and then Auto Build tab. Enter 10 here and click Save. Now I already have articles here. Remember, although we are building articles for GSA, we will select Text Articles and click Build. We wait for a while and then WAC will show you a window with all the articles. Now go to WAC API and click Generate and you will get an ID. In GSA Article Manager, click on Add and then on Use WAC and paste this ID. Remember, this ID is not same as the one you get from GSA Module in WAC. I will explain in a while. Press OK and you will see all your articles here. You might see all articles look same but they are not. You can click Preview to see the difference. Now there are two IDs which WAC generates. One is GSA Project ID. This is generated when you build GSA Project in WAC and import it in GSA through Autofill in Tools. The other ID is Articles ID which is generated from text articles and is imported in Article Manager in GSA. Now let's see how Multi-Campaign Builder works and how to import content into multiple GSA campaigns. This feature is only for premium members. If you want, you can upgrade your copy to use this. To begin, Go to WAC Premium section and click on Multi-GSA. Enter your keyword here. Now you can either choose articles from Scraper section or select a file. Remember, you can export articles from WAC Main Scraper to a XML file. Here you need to select that XML file. Now choose the number of campaigns and hit Build. It will start building campaigns and display the number of campaign, result, and error if any. Remember to use proxies as WAC will translate content for each field which means too many calls will be made to Google Translate and this can ban your IP. It will list multiple steps needed in each campaign and will show any error that particular step had. After it has built the campaigns, it will transfer the whole campaign to our database and give you an ID. Now let's see how to transfer data to multiple campaigns using this ID. In GSA, make sure you have multiple campaigns added. Now double click any campaign to open the project window. Now click on Tools, Autofill and click on Use WAC ID. Enter your ID but after it enter a hyphen and then the number of campaign you want content from. Remember we built 5 campaigns in GSA so here you paste the ID and then add minus 1 after it. Click OK and then GSA will ask you to select the fields and it will fill them. Similarly, to enter content for another GSA campaign, double-click the project, go to Tools Autofill, select WAC, and paste the ID and then enter minus 2. This will fill content from second project in the campaign. This way you can enter for 3, 4, and 5 2 by just entering your project ID minus 1, 2, 3, etc. This way, you can build multiple campaigns for your GSA project very easily. All you need to do is scrape articles per keyword and then use this to build campaigns from the exported XML file. If you have any questions, then head to our Help Desk section and create a ticket for us to help you out. 